we need to address it. It's, it's a big problem. For the second straight weekend, a hit and run sent pedestrians to the hospital. The latest one happening on McKinley Avenue near Southwest 6th Street. The driver hit two people and sped off. It makes me not want to live here anymore. Caitlin Gruis lives right next to where the accident happened. It's really uncomfortable. I walk every day with my daughter, so I, it makes me feel unsafe to be walking in the neighborhood. Nationally, pedestrian related deaths are on a sharp increase, and it's the same trend in our state. In Iowa, we are seeing a rise in pedestrian uh, deaths. Brett Jepkes is the bureau chief for the Governor's Traffic Safety Bureau. He says they're focused on eliminating distracted driving, and he's bringing in police departments, educators, and other agencies to address this growing issue. Everybody's going to be here this week and, and uh, give us some recommendations, and it's his uh, assessment team will give us some recommendations on how we can improve and, and reverse the trend of, of Iowa's fatalities. Van Taylor has a simple message for drivers. Tell people to get off their damn phones. He says he sees distracted drivers and pedestrians every single day. There are more important things in life than being on that damn phone. I mean, you walk down the street, everybody's on their phone. I mean, it's stupid. Now, Des Moines police have identified the vehicle in this hit and run here on McKinley Avenue, and they're still investigating the one that happened a couple weekends ago, and Des Moines police say they, too, are seeing an increase in pedestrian-related crashes. We're live in Des Moines. Scott Carpenter, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.